book 365. Good morning, good morning. Welcome back to Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels. And today I'm going to tell you guys about the man who wrote 365 short motivational stories in 365 days. That's right. The man who wrote 365 short motivational stories in 365 days. But what is Matthew Daniels talking about? Um, a long, long time ago, in an area of the earth that we call Texas City, Texas today, a man named Matthew James Daniels made history by following his heart and always striving to do that which is good. This man, who was one of my ancestors no less, always felt in his heart that he was quite literally born to write. In his mind, he had lived many lives prior to the one he was currently living, and in every single life he lived in the past, he was a great scribe who wrote works that would last for thousands of years. In his current life, however, although he knew he was destined to write yet another powerful piece of literary genius, he did not know where to begin or exactly what to write about. This caused him great frustration and made him wonder about his purpose on earth often. Then one day, by pure happenstance, he stepped into the fulfillment of his life's work. This man had a job which required him to go to work very early in the morning, and since he did not want to disturb his beautiful and loving wife, Raquel, Matthew would walk the short distance from his home to his work. As he walked, he would give himself motivational pep talks, and he would let his imagination run wild as he smelled the fresh air, felt the cool breeze, and gazed up at the stars. One day, as if a voice was whispering into his ear, Matthew had the idea to record himself speaking about the thoughts of his mind so that he could share with the world how he motivated himself each day and hopefully help someone else motivate themselves. So, he began to do just that. Each day, as he walked to work, he would turn on his camera, say good morning to the people, and then he would give them a unique teaching on how to become the best version of themselves and how to accomplish their goals in life. Since this man loved to read as much as he loved to write, he had a deep reservoir of ancient tales in his mind that he would summarize for the people and then he would use the story to illustrate how a person should behave in life. After many days, he slowly began to run out of story ideas to correlate with his motivational messages and he wondered what he would do. Then it hit him. He himself felt as if he was a reincarnated scribe from the past and he felt as if he was one of the greatest scribes to ever exist. So he told himself that if someone else could write the stories that he had recited so far, then he himself could write new stories that he could recite in the days moving forward. And so that's exactly what he did. Each new day, Matthew would wake up, tap into the depths of his mind, write a new short motivational story and use that new story to inspire the people who would listen. He did this every single day for about 30 days straight and he realized that he had written an entire book's worth of short stories. His wife, Raquel, asked him how many stories he intended to write and when he said that he did not know, she suggested that he should write 365 new and original short motivational stories, one for each day of the year. And she said that he should compile these stories into 12 different books that could correlate with the 12 months of the year. Matthew was unsure if he could pull it off, but a voice came to him and said that this task was the task for which he was born. And if he wanted to write a work that would truly last for a thousand years, then this was the work that he must write. So he compiled his first 30 short motivational stories into a book called Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels, Volume 1 and he set out on his literary journey. Day after day, week after week, and month after month, Matthew woke up, imagined a new adventure in his mind, wrote a new original short story, and he used that story to encourage people to be good, righteous, upright, and to always follow their heart. Many days, he wondered if he would complete his monumental task, and many days he felt as if the end was nowhere in sight. But he knew that if he only followed the advice that he was giving to the people, he would ultimately be successful. So, as he daily told people to be good and follow their heart, he was actually being good and following his own heart. And so the ancestors and the great God helped him to complete his task. When the time came for him to write his last short motivational story, he contemplated what exactly he should write about. Then he decided that he should write briefly about the journey that led him to that point. That day, he sat down at his computer and he wrote the title, 
the man who wrote 365 short motivational stories in 365 days. And he knew in that very moment that he was proving to the entire world one fundamental reality of life. He was proving that if you want to become successful and if you want to achieve your dreams and goals, all you need to do is be good, upright, avoid evil and follow your heart. In every single day of your life, you must push towards becoming the best version of yourself. If you would only do this, Matthew had proven, you would indeed change the world. And so the morning motivation of today is the man who wrote 365 short motivational stories in 365 days. Today, I want you all to simply let my journey inspire you. Every motivational speaker I have ever listened to has said that you must be consistent, disciplined, determined, and relentless. They have all said that you must chase your dreams every single day. And while I too have told you this repeatedly throughout these past 365 days, I have also gone one step further. I have shown you in real time what that actually looks like. I have lived the message that I am giving. So today, as you go about your day, make today like every other day. Be good, be upright, be courageous, and be caring. And always strive to do that which is good. And remember... You are awesome, you are amazing, you are wonderful, and you are great. And you are going to change the world. I just hope I'm still alive to see it, family. I'm out. Good morning. To order books and the Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels book series, search Morning Motivation with Matthew Daniels on Amazon.com or visit www.dandyandbigherm.com.